Praise the Lord, everybody. This is Elder Rogers coming to you live all the way from YouTube here at Praise Capital, Kingdom Mind and Ministry Central. It is such a privilege and an honor to know that you all continue to subscribe to these videos. We're asking that not only you subscribe, that you would rate, post, comment, and share these videos. We've reached well over 10,000 subscribers and close to 19 million video views because of your support. We don't take it for granted. Oh my goodness, we are so grateful. It is in him that we live, we move, and we have our being. It is such a privilege and an honor to know that you all still love this channel, but most importantly that these blessings are flowing because of the videos that you're watching. And we're thanking God for you today. We're thanking God that you have uh, inboxed me how these videos have started your day out, that you were depressed, that you did have low self-esteem, but because of what the man or woman of God ministered to you in this video with, that you no longer are there and you are no longer the same. And that is the power that we that works in us mightily. The Bible says in Luke 10, 19, Behold, I give unto thee power, power to trample upon serpents and scorpion and over all of the power of the enemy. And I want to encourage you today to let you know that you've got power. You've got power to overcome everything that you've been going through. How do you know, Elder Rogers? Well, the Bible says, greater is he that is within you than he that is in the world. I commend you and recommend you today uh, to know Jesus Christ. He is the only name under heaven whereby men might be saved. And we thank God for the influence, the power, the anointing of the risen Savior who lives today and because he lives I can face tomorrow because he lives all fear is gone because I know who holds the future and life is worth the living because Jesus lives one of the quotes I want to leave with you is one of my favorite preachers and that's Dr. Willie James Campbell he would say the depth of your suffering determines the height of your anointing if you're not willing to go through anything you're not willing to get to anything I'm so excited today to let you know that everything that I've been through was for the making of me. I'm excited and elated to know that this is not all that God has for me. I want to include you in that blessing to let you know that God is getting ready to do wonders in your life. Oh my God, Jeremiah 29 and 11 says, for I know the thoughts that I have towards you, say of God, hallelujah, thoughts of peace and not of evil to give you an expected end. And that's exactly Exactly what God is getting ready to do in your life. Give you a season of expectancy. The Bible says if a man's ways please the Lord, he'll give him the desire of his heart. Today, I thank God for you. Uh, I thank God for your example. I thank God for you continuing to bless this ministry by merely posting, that merely, my, by merely sharing, by doing the things that God loves most importantly, giving someone else Jesus Christ. May God continue to bless you. It is with kingdom blessings that I salute you today. God bless you with the blessings of God that maketh rich and addeth no sorrow.